Hey guys, how's it going? It's Kim here. And today we are getting the um, pawpaws planted. Um, I've, like I said before, I'm not sure that these are going to work at all. Um, I did not do this process right. I put them in the container with all my other seeds and forgot to put them in the refrigerator. So I did not harden them off and they have to be hardened off. Hopefully they were hard enough for a little while before I got them. They were in baggies, so I don't know. The roots grew and some of them are trying to push out the top. So we may get a few of them. I'm hoping that we get at least, I don't know, I have 10 seeds. So I hope that we will get at least four or five plants, I hope. I'm going to give some to my sister and some to my daughter. So I'm hoping that we at least have enough to do that. Even if we only have one apiece, we can try again next year. Well, not next year. But we can try again when we finally get some fruit off of one and we can have more if we want because I think they're a little hard to get a hold of. I'm going to let you see what they look like right now and what we're going to plant them in. It's a little bright in here today. Um, so this is what they look like, and they've all got the long tap root on them. Um, I think. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, they all have a tap root on them. They all have secondary roots on them. If you can see that, they were in a baggie of dirt, and that's how they grew. I was I was shocked that they actually grew like this. Like, some of them do not have a lot of secondary roots. Some of them have a ton, like this one right here. It has a lot of secondary roots on it already. Um, so, we're going to get these in the dirt. Uh, well, that one's pretty good. I'm only going to question probably this one right here. It doesn't have a lot of secondary roots. The rest of them do. So, um, if we lose any, I suspect we're going to lose one, possibly two. But I'm really not thrilled about the way this one looks compared to the rest of them. If this looks familiar, it's because this is the place that I had... Most of my seeds stored in. They were in a few other places that I rounded up and put them all together. But this is what I naturally put them in. Someone left me a comment to use it for soil. And I thought that was a pretty good idea. It was a pretty good size. And so I um, put my soil in it. And it was working perfect. Um, then I was reading on how to plant these pawpaws. And I saw a lot of people put them in um, like tree tubes. And I don't have any of those, but I do have this container. And um, the tap roots will get as, as long as you give them room to grow. So I thought that I would put them in here. Initially, I was going to put them in these little, these little pots. But then I held the tap root up to it, and they were already that long. So... We're going to use this container, and I'm going to try to put them close enough to the sides where I can see and monitor if they're growing. Because if they're not growing, I'm not going to waste all this soil if they're not going to grow. Um, so we're going to go ahead and get these 10 pawpaws planted. Like I said, there's a couple that look a little, yeah, not as good as the others. But we're going to give it all a shot, and we're going to get them planted. Okay, first we're going to add some water to the soil because it's pretty dried out and we will be getting it moist. And now it is time to start planting. So the seed you're going to want to be to the top and the roots all the way on the bottom. And that one looks like a really good one. I have high hopes for that. So, I guess I'll just use the bottom of the spoon. You want to make sure that it's deep enough. And I'm going to try to get it on the side so that we might be able to see this grow. I hope. 
and it's trying to push out the top so I'm not gonna bury the top too too much so that we can kind of see what's going on with it there we go and they're not all trying to do that like the this one is um, the bean fell off of it And I'm trying to get them on the side so we can monitor their growth. And I think that's going to work out really well, honestly. This container might do well, guys. I don't know. We're going to see. And let's plant another one. And this one looks pretty good, too. It's starting to try to come up to the top. So these three, I'm having high hopes for them. I really hope that this works. I should have gotten them planted a long time ago, but sometimes things get away from you. So we're going to put this one, put it over here because I, this is one, this is one I honestly don't think is going to do much, but we're going to give the guy a little shot. No harm, no foul. And I'm just going to cover him all the way up. And this one's not trying to sprout out the top, but it does have quite a bit of um, secondary roots. So. And it really wasn't good that I left them in that baggie for so long. Another one. And it's really not, it's kind of trying to come up the top. I think I'm just going to cover that one as well. It'll push through. Or it won't. We don't know. But it'd be really exciting. Even if I get one of these to grow. I'm not going to feel so bad, but if I don't get any of these to grow, I'm actually going to be pretty mad at myself, honestly, because I was so excited for these. And we've only got a few more to plant. And this little guy is trying to pop out the top, too, and it did lose the seed, so oh, it's really long. So it looks like we've got them all planted. I'll give you a look and see what it looks like right now. Because there's a few of them that you can actually see. And there's the longest one. So I'm thinking that that one's going to do fairly well. And then there's one right here. And it's already sticking out. There's another one there. And this little guy is, you can see him right there. The rest on the other side, all of those and the ones on these sides were not popping through. So I just covered that back side all the way and we'll see if any of them start to grow. Well guys, I hope you liked that video and I hope you crossed your fingers because we need these pawpaws to grow. And I will keep you updated. They'll probably be in the vlog that you're gonna see every Saturday of what's going on through the week. That's probably the best place we'll update them, but I'll keep them updated and let you know if they're growing or what they're doing. The same with the loofah. Um, you'll see that update on the weekend vlog. So if you haven't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. Stick around, see if we can get this stuff to grow. I'm not perfect at growing things, and like I said, the pawpaws should have been in the refrigerator. They should have hardened off, but instead they grew. So we'll see if we get any. I don't know. Until next time, bye guys.